Hi, welcome. We are going to learn the third canon of Christmas today for December 27th, which is also the Feast of St. John. This is a three-part canon setting of John chapter 1, verse 14, and it's called, And the Word Became Flesh. I'm here with my friends Miguel and Mirin, and we're going to sing this for you one time in unison and then launch right into a three-part canon so you can hear what it sounds like. After that, I'll teach you each phrase and you can try to learn them and then jump back in and sing with us at the end. So here's what it sounds like. Ready? And the Word became flesh and dwelt among us. And we have seen his glory, glory as of the only Son, from the Father full of grace, grace and truth. And the Word became flesh and dwelt among us. And the Word became and flesh and dwelt among us. us. And the Word became as flesh we have seen his glory. And that's what it sounds like. So there are four phrases, which means you could actually sing this as a four-part canon if you wanted to. Uh, I will teach you each phrase. You repeat after me, and Miguel and Mirren will be singing with you, so you just kind of stay with them. First phrase sounds like this. And the Word became flesh and dwelt among us. And the Word became flesh and dwelt among us. Great. And now there are always, every canon has its own sort of tricky elements. There aren't any very difficult parts to sing in this canon, but what can be a little bit tricky, particularly if you're not following along with music, is the timing. So that among us brings us right over top of the entrance of the second phrase. So we'll actually start with a rest, and it will sound like this. <sighs> And we have seen his glory. And we have seen his glory. Good. So just so we can feel that timing a little bit better, let's put phrases one and two together before we move on to phrase three. So I'll sing it. You repeat. And the word became flesh and dwelt among us. And we have seen his glory. And the word became flesh and dwelt among us. And we have seen his glory. Okay, moving on to the second half, third phrase sounds like this. Glory as of the only Son from the Father. Glory as of the only Son from the Father. Great. Going on into the fourth phrase, sounds like this. Full of grace, grace and truth. Full of grace, grace and truth. Good. And just because we did this in the first half, let's do the same thing and put phrases three and four together before we... Try the whole thing. So phrase three and four sound like this. Glory as of the only Son from the Father full of grace, grace and truth. Glory as of the only Son from the Father full of grace, grace and truth. Great. And that's the whole thing. Not too bad. Not too long. So now you can, we're going to sing this whole thing three times together in unison and try and sing with us and use it also as a bit of a diagnostic tool. If you find that you're getting off on the second phrase every time, you may want to go back in the video and just isolate that chunk a few times before you try to move on to canon. So let's do it three times through. First phrase, ready? <sighs> And the Word became flesh and dwelt among us. And we have seen His glory, 
Glory as of the only Son, from the Father full of grace. Grace and truth, and the Word became flesh and dwelt among us. And we have seen his glory, glory as of the only Son, from the Father full of grace. Grace and truth, and the Word became flesh and dwelt among us. And we have seen his glory, glory as of the only Son, from the Father full of grace. Grace and truth. Great. And if that's still going well for you, we're just going to power right in to a three-part canon. So we'll do this three times as well. Mirren is going to start. So if you're just kind of hanging on for dear life here, I would recommend just singing with her the whole time. As you've probably heard me say before, if you've watched any of these videos, the first step to being able to do this is just building the independence to stay on your own part while you're hearing other things happen. If that's already pretty comfortable and you're singing in a group or with your family, then go ahead and jump into two or even three parts. I will come in second, Miguel will come in third, and as I said before, if you for whatever reason have eight competent singers and want to go two to a part and add a fourth part, go ahead and do so, but we'll be sticking with three. So go ahead whenever you're ready, Mary. And the word became flesh and dwelt among us. And the word became and flesh we and have seen his glory. And the word became as of the only son from the Father full of glory. As of the only son from the Father full of glory. As of the only son from the Father full of glory. That's the whole thing. I hope you had some success keeping on your own part, and I hope this edified your Christmas tide celebration. As you may already know, we'll be doing a canon every day for the whole 12 days of Christmas. So if you've done the first three, why stop now? Keep going. We'll be going all the way through the 12th day of Christmas, and I hope you'll sing with us, and I hope that this uh, gets your family singing God's word and writing it onto the tablet of your hearts. Thank you. <laughs> 